The halls of McLean High School are a welcoming sight for Crystal Garcia. Just like your second home, and you really don't want to leave. When she first stepped foot inside, school wasn't her main focus. Part of my freshman year, I used to be like a little bit rebellious. But she quickly chose to take a different path, not wanting any opportunities to slip by. So I decided I want to do better. Since then, she has rose to be in the top five of her class. <laughs> I felt proud of myself. <laughs> While in high school, Crystal even took advantage of opportunities to better herself outside of the classroom. She's like really <laughs> like intelligent but not braggy about it and loves to like just be about herself and getting things done. She joined the Tulsa Debate League, believing it would give her confidence and help her better master the English language. The reading part is like was really hard for me. I wouldn't understand it, but like I'd go through it with uh, the debate coach and understand it better and how to have a better sense of arguments. She also wanted to lead her class, becoming senior class secretary. I wanted to get involved and make the like our senior uh, trips and prom better. But she did not take on these challenges for herself. She did it for her classmates. That's my first priority, like other people. I feel like I care more about others than myself because I like want all my classmates to succeed. This was obvious from the beginning of her high school journey. McLean hadn't had a girls soccer team in years, so Crystal stepped in. Our first coach um, and some other girls were like wanting to play and we didn't have a team. Starting a high school team from scratch is no easy task. Crystal rallied players and kept up their spirit. What started as a team of seven grew more and more each year. And I got more girls to join and from there we, we had a team. Her coach and teacher Jordan Tamayo says without a leader like Crystal, the girls at McLean would not have gotten to play soccer. I sometimes call her coach because she tells me what to do, depends on the day. It's a responsibility Crystal enjoys, knowing she has opportunities to better the lives of those around her. I don't know, I like like telling people what to do and like leading them to do better. Crystal's mother and older brothers are from Guatemala. They came to Tulsa because her mom wanted her family to have a better life. Crystal saying, life can be hard for an immigrant family living in the United States. What some other people don't see is like, what you go through as a family. Like. Immigration is a topic she is passionate about. People don't see what like your side of the story, they just see what like they hear. And I just wanna like put my voice out there. Saying she hopes more Americans can set aside their assumptions and view people individually. So not every immigrant is the same. And in doing so, gain a new appreciation for the rich, vibrant culture that immigrants add to our nation. A lot of the stuff here we have like in America is like the culture of the Latino population. Crystal also has a love for the arts, saying it sets her free. There's like an art, there's no wrong. Her plan after graduation is to join the Army Reserves while attending TCC, hoping one day to be a police detective where she can help people in need. Because I feel like no one would um, see like a girl like me doing something like that and I want to prove people wrong. Crystal says she wouldn't feel so successful if not for her McLean family. The administration and the teachers just really want to help you. Encouraging others at McLean to stay focused. If you really focus on school and like just follow directions, it'll go by so quick. Knowing they will be rewarded in life after graduation. Because throughout life you're going to get told what to do. And even wherever you work, you're going to get told what to do and you may not like to do something, but you still have to do it, even if it's your job. I'm excited to see all the great things that will come out of you. The way that you feel now and how like strong you are for yourself and how dedicated you are to doing what's right and doing good things, like don't ever lose sight of why you're doing it and keep being that person because never once have you stopped being the person that does the right thing. Crystal's parting advice for future Titans, find your mentor and believe in yourself. Someone believes in you and there's someone out there and even if it's just like a one person that believes in you, no matter what, you should still try. Oh!